here comes my mother. What's up guys? I just got back home from Texas and we didn't get a single hog down there. We had like five opportunities and didn't end up killing a hog. So got my fishing poles right here. We took those down to Texas, but didn't end up doing any fishing. So tomorrow I'm heading to Wisconsin, gonna meet up with Jake and we're gonna do a little bit of fishing tomorrow, but I don't know what to talk about. Let's go see what my mother's doing. What are you doing? How was work? How was it? How was Texas? It's pretty good. We didn't end up getting anything though. That stinks. You need help carrying in groceries? I don't need any help, no. No? Alright. I'm good. What do you got there? Same oh cocktail? God. Don't look at that. Don't film that. That's naughty. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Bachelorette party. Gotcha. That's my mother, Jane. She just got home from work. So I got a softball game tonight at 8 and 9. So that's what I'm going to be doing tonight. I'll probably have a, my mom film a few clips of me batting up there. We'll see how it goes. Last time it went pretty well. Last time I went like 4 for 6. So not too bad. I love playing softball. I went with this team last week, played the same thing 8 to 9 doubleheader. And we lost the first game and then won the second game by a long shot. So I'm looking forward to it again. They asked me to come back, so that's pretty sweet. Been shooting my bow, editing videos today, talking to Chester a little bit, playing my guitar, all kinds of stuff. Tomorrow I'll head to Wisconsin and we'll see if we can get some fish. Got the new canoe strapped up here on the Honda. This thing has been a great vehicle. It's got like 210,000 miles. Runs great. I haven't really had to do much to it. I change the oil like every 3,000 miles and that's about it. Got a little Gucci TV sticker on there. Gotta have that on there. Go check out his YouTube channel if you haven't already. Got my cleats. <laughs> I bought these for like 15 bucks at Played Against Sports. So they get the job done. Walking down to the basement. Looks like Frank showed up last night. Him and dad were out here having a few drinks. Dad's got his bow out here. He's been shooting. I think he's going elk hunting. I think Dad's going elk hunting September 1st out in Colorado. That'll be pretty sweet. I think that time frame I'll be in Wyoming. I met up with him last year and we got on a few bowls, but hopefully I can go back out this year and knock one down. You guys gotta see this. Our neighbors down below us. This is my parents' house and I'm just up here for now during the summer months and uh, the neighbors moved in this house went for sale below us and they've got all kinds of animals down there which is awesome we just love watching them we sit up there on the deck we watch them every night pretty much and they got goats chickens cows here he's coming up here i'll just walk away here quick but <laughs> they got like goats chicken cows dogs ducks geese the whole nine turkeys which is pretty sweet we get to hear them gobble and yelping every single day pretty much but I'll give you a quick look here there's the neighbors down there with all the all the farm animals but here's where I have been sitting and editing most of the day right here it's a pretty good view as you can see sit here on the deck and edit ranch ferry videos and then I'll be editing this one here in a minute pretty good setup especially on days like today it's like 60 degrees but oh I gotta show you guys something in the basement that we got so you guys probably remember when Jake and I went and hunted with Ted Miller last winter we shot a coyote I missed a coyote and then Ted shot a coyote like 100 yards and then we shot a coon like the next day called him right out of his den tree so anyways i brought those back and my dad's buddy frank is a big time trapper traps every year tans all the hides and takes them to the trappers convention so i gave him those two hides and i just got them back the other day they're awesome i'll give you a better look at them here in a second but you got the coon on top and that's the coyote that ted shot there back behind him it turned out really well here's the coon that i shot you can see he's all tanned out. It's pretty neat. 
pretty cool to be able to keep their hides like that and, and either sell them or just hold on to them for whatever you might want to do with them. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with them yet. I'll probably hang them up down at the house that Jake and I rent since he was long for that hunt. That'd be a pretty cool thing to have hanging on the wall. This coyote is pretty neat too. As you can see, I am not very good at skinning these things out. So next time I see Frank, he's going to have to give me a lesson on how to skin them out. But it's pretty neat. Anyway, I got to head to the ball field here soon. And I'll see you after that. There it is. Get two, get two. Get three, get three, get three. Three! Oh. I should have had that one over. Yeah. Yes. Yes, I did it. All right guys, it is Wednesday and it's like 10 o'clock at night. But just wanted to show you this uh, piece that we picked up this afternoon. Me and dad went and picked up a new amp. So that's pretty sweet. Called a monster. Actually, I'm not sure what it's called. I'd have to look. Let me grab the box outside here. Oh yeah, the rock and, the rock and roller monster amp. Just let in a bunch of bugs. Now, got my amp my harmonicas my martin so i should be pretty set for this friday i'm pretty pumped it's gonna be it's gonna be fun it's beginning a fourth of july weekend hopefully people are fired up i put a few things out on my instagram telling them to swing over there probably put one more thing out tomorrow on thursday to let people know but we'll say hopefully some people show up if not have a good time anyway but the next thing i need to learn is how to play these harmonicas. This one is a uh, E harmonica. <whistles> Wrong side. <whistles> That's a little better. But that adds a lot to the music, so I need to figure that out. Here's one I worked on tonight a little bit. I'll play a little, play a little bit of it. I gotta pull up the words. Say my mammy left me the day before she had me hit the hit the road and never once looked back. I've been to Georgia on a fast train, honey. That ends in more no yesterday. It's a good upbeat song for when everybody starts getting rowdy. Figure that one would be a good one to throw in there. <sighs> Alright, it's about eleven o'clock, so I'm gonna work on the computer for a little bit longer and go to sleep get up and hit in the morning. So see you guys then.